two guys in a vape shop saying positive things. What's up, everybody? I'm Josh. I'm Greg. My special guest today, Mr. Greg, uh, one of the regulars here at Battleground Vapors. And today we've got another episode of Two Guys in a Vape Shop Saying Positive Things. So how are you doing today, buddy? Doing well. Just got off work, came yeah. to the vape shop, trying out some new juice. And, right, right. You know, some good stuff. Having a good day, though? Pretty good day, man. Yeah? How was work? A little bit tiring. Right. Couldn't vape the whole time, but uh, yeah. it's always good to get off work and yeah. uh, be able to hang out with some friends here at the vape oh, shop. Yeah. yeah, I'm extremely lucky to work in a vape shop so I can vape all day. Yeah. I, I like vape for a living. It's pretty awesome. It's pretty sweet. It's, awesome. it's a good deal. It's a good deal. I would do this shit for minimum wage probably. I don't know about minimum wage, but... <laughs> I mean, it's better than McDonald's minimum wage. But hey, if you work at McDonald's and you make minimum wage, good on you, bro, because you got a job. You know? True. We keep it positive here. Positive. 100% positive. 100% positive. All the time. All the time. <laughs> oh, man. Yes. There it is. Yes. Don't know if y'all heard that, but he, he what he said was right. It's the truth. It's the truth. Very positive. Um, the vape of the day. The uh, Segeli 150 Watt Plus right here. Uh, we've got that in black or blue. Uh, pretty sweet mod. It's like the 150 original, uh, but it'll fire down to 0.1, so it's a little more stable. Uh, you can push the limits a little more. Yeah. You know. And uh, we're, we've been digging it with the Arctic on top. This Arctic is pretty sweet. It's awesome. I had a chance to check out the Arctic for the first time in an episode of So Much Vape. I was a special guest host. Uh, so go check that out. I'll put a link below. Uh, pretty pretty cool group of guys, and we were hanging out at Precious Vapes out in Madison. You ever been to Precious Vapes? Never been out there, but I've only heard good things. Oh, it, only so. good things. It's yeah. a great store. Uh, Steve out there. Last week, can you believe he donated all the profits all day Sunday to TSFA? That's awesome. That's about as positive as it gets. I don't know if you can get any more positive than that. Uh, you can't. That's like 110% positive. 110. And we because he spends anywhere between 80 and 110 percent of his time being positive. I don't know if you've seen that video. Have you seen that video? I've not seen the that Rip video, Trippers. We'll watch that. that. We'll watch that later. And we'll put a link below. If you haven't seen the Rip Trippers video by Matter Mardigan, you need to check it out. Um, so, what do you think about the Arctic? Um, the Arctic. It, you need you need you need a couple of tokes to re refresh your memory. It uh, the airflow is amazing. Yeah. Um, no constriction to the airflow. Um, good flavor. Got to be the most airflow for any su clear sub tank clear miser on the market easily. Yeah. Um, the reason I like it is because you can r run it at a high wattage and yeah. it's still a cool vape. Yeah. You know. Absolutely. Um, any other tank that you run at a high wattage, you're gonna be burning through coils. Yeah. Um, it's gonna be a hot, nasty vape. Yeah. The Arctic is a cool vape. Produces a lot of vapor. And the flavor's amazing. Yeah, it really is. It really is. It surprised the hell out of me. Because after the Atlantis debacle of 2014, I just kind of swore off subtanks. Um, but this one's kind of bringing me back around. It's bringing me back around. The rating I gave on So Much Vape was a like it. I think I might change that to a love it. One of these two remaining Arctics might be going home with me today. Yep. We've got it on 60 watts right now. And it has a .2 coil in it. Yeah. And it's... The performance is amazing. The one thing I would recommend is definitely breaking in your wick on these guys before you vape at high wattages because you can screw up your wick really quickly. Definitely like take it through its paces. Start off at 30 watts, 40 watts, hit it a few times, the work it on up to where you want it. Yeah, yeah. The um, Arctic website, whoever makes the tank uh, on their website, has a. Uh, step-by-step -step instructions how to break the wick in. Yeah, so. yeah. And we'll link you to the Horizon Tech. Uh, I think it's Horizon e sigcom is what it looks like from here. So yeah. we'll link you to that. Uh, yeah. yeah, but I've been enjoying the Arctic. It's pretty good stuff. Uh, right now I have a mix of some other juices in it. It's a pretty interesting menthol blend by our one and only Solomon, yeah. uh, a build master. You want a little cameo? No. This will peek your head in a little bit? No. Just Come solo, on. man. Solon's being shy today, but you know we're gonna oh, stay right. positive and say that he wanted to, but he's busy right now. Yeah, he's so. very busy eating <laughs> something. He's eating something. It's like a little prairie dog, you know. He, he just pops his head out of the hole sometimes, and you know, then he'll go back in to build the soil. Prairie dogs uh -huh. are cute, you know. Yeah. yeah. Prairie, prairie yeah. dogs are awesome. One hundred percent. One hundred percent positive. One hundred ten percent. One hundred ten percent. That's our. Uh, that's my quote for the day. One hundred ten percent. Right. Um, our juice of the week uh, was going to be the vigilante. 
Juice Company. Awesome company. Uh, the fellow that owns it and his, uh, his old lady, uh, Russ and Ashley. Great people. Super positive all the time. They have some great flavors. Uh, one of my favorites has got to be Rogue. Uh, the description uh, as such. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Unprepared as always. A smooth, rich blend of French vanilla custard accented with shaved young coconut and a drizzle of caramel. They went the extra mile to get the young coconut, not an old coconut. A premature coconut, you know, and it's a, right. it's a good taste. Yeah. Which one is your favorite, sir? Um, I'm probably going to have to agree with the Rogue. Yeah. It, um, it's not a harsh, it's not too strong with vanilla custard. It's very subtle, but you get a good flavor. Yeah. Um, I like that little hint of caramel. I don't get much coconut, which for me is a good thing because I'm yeah. not a fan of coconut, even if it is young and shaved. It's kind of weird, but we're going to stay positive and just oh, yeah, say that's, yeah. that's awesome that it's young and shaved. Absolutely. I don't know if you could get any more positive than that. <laughs> yep. Um, but, uh, yeah, as, as I said, the flavor's there. You know, um, with other vanilla custards I've had, it's, you get a really eggy taste. Yeah. Um, it's just too much. And it's, yeah. uh, it is definitely an all-day vape for me, um, especially out of the Arctic tank. Out of any tank, yeah. that is, uh, you get the full flavor. Yeah. Um, dripping, it's it's a good, all, all together, all around, it's a good flavor. Yeah. The whole Vigilante juice line is great. I mean, you can put them in your sub tanks, they're awesome. You can drip them, they're awesome. They stand up well to heat. Uh, a good close, probably a close second for me would have to be Grey Ghost. It's an awesome Earl Grey with a little bit of cream. Fantastic juice. Um, and all of the Vigilante line is available here at the wonderful Battleground Vapors. Uh, it's going to run you about 22 bucks a bottle retail. We carry everything from uh, 0, 03, 6, 12, 18. No, yep. I don't know that we carry 18 in Vigilante. I think it goes up to 12. Yeah, 0, 03, 6, and 12. Yep. Yeah. But, uh, you know, these juices are thicker, so you're not really going to be putting them in your CE4s and your iClear 16, so no. it's okay that they're a bit I'm going to say the mix is like a 70-30. Yeah, that's what we'd call it. That's what I got on the menu, 70-30. So it's, um, at, with the Arctic Tank, you can put a little bit of a thicker juice in there, um, just because of how hot, oh, yeah, those, how hot you're burning it. Those like, channels? Yeah. Those juice flow channels? Dude, they're yeah. huge. They're like as big as the tank. Yeah, it's crazy. pretty awesome. They couldn't have made them any bigger. Yeah, and the, they're 110 percent of the size that they need to be. Yeah, it was crazy. I came in to buy an Arctic. I think it was, I think it was Saturday. I came in to buy an Arctic, and they were all sold out. They yeah. they sell out as soon as they get. And them we in. got them that Thursday. Yeah, so I think they got 10 of them in or something like that, and they were gone and. In like less than 48 hours. Yeah. Yeah. Which is amazing. Yeah. Um, I I've heard nothing but positive things about it. Oh yeah. Um, it's a great tank. Yeah. The one thing that I would have liked to have seen them include is an extra piece of glass. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. You know, but the price point you can't complain too much. No. It's like 40 bucks. Yeah. And for a killer sub tank. Yeah. And um, and you also you get the the option. It comes with a 0.5 coil and a 0.2 um, coil. So you have the option of running the standard 0.5 coil, which would be the same as the Atlantis in there, or you can step it up a little bit and go to the 0.2. Yeah. And um. We just were, knock your yeah, socks off. Yeah, the first day they got them in, we were vaping it at 100 watts on an IPv3, and it was performing. You know, yeah. no dry hit, wasn't burnt. Um, it was, it's amazing. But yeah. I'm not going to suggest running it at 100 watts on an IPv3. Um, <laughs> it was just you could kind of, have a bad time. Yeah, you, you could, could have, have a bad, bad time. time. But not here on this show. No, um, never. Will not we in this shop. Uh, I, I'm not going to say anybody's ever had a bad time with an Arctic tank. Right. Because we're staying positive today. Yeah, we've all had nothing but uh, nothing but. Good feedback on the Arctic so far. Um, so yeah, uh, we got a new microphone rocking. So hopefully that eliminated a whole lot of the background noise that y'all were talking about in the last video. Uh, so tell us what you think. Uh, this is episode two of, of the two guys in a vape shop saying positive things, um, and we want to know what you think. If you don't like it, we'll stop making them. If you want to keep seeing this stuff every week, we'll keep knocking them out. We're gonna keep it 110 percent with you guys. One hundred and ten percent. Always. Always. Above and beyond. To infinity and beyond. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's how it goes, man. That's how it goes. Yep. As a matter of fact, let's go watch Toy Story. Let's... Toy Story is an awesome movie. Let's do it. All right, y'all. We got to go. Thanks for joining us. Tell us what you think in the comments below. Um, yeah. And keep it positive. Much love, y'all. Thanks, guys. I wish they would make a toy story where they meet Angie's mom's toys. Oh man, that'd be crazy. <laughs> <laughs>
That's awesome. You know they like they did a play on that with uh, the, the the toys that the guy was putting together or whatever, mm -hmm. like the bad kid next door, <coughs> the one with the fish hook. Yeah. She's a hooker. Ah. Yeah. That's awesome. She, I see she's that. got like Barbie doll legs and thigh highs and yeah. a fish hook. She's a hooker. She's a hooker, bro. Yeah. Ah. What kind of are we talking about? Adult jokes slipped into Pixar movies. Well, she does wear thigh highs. So she does wear thigh highs. That's pretty cool. Well, that's hey, I'm all business, but I like to party. No, I like, like bullet. business in the front bullet, yeah. That's what a bullet does. Yeah. That's amazing. Business up front, party in the back. Hey, dude, first time I went to rehab, they shaved my head. I got power fade bullet. It was ridiculous, dude. I had the dirtiest bullet in the South, I guarantee. I want to buy it. Okay. Like 100%. 100%. 100%. Did you get hit like we were up here? Dude, it amazes me how stupid people are, Solomon. Yeah? Am I even all the way in the frame? I don't think I can do short, bro. I'm hella short. Appreciate it, Josh. It's okay, you're short, but you're stocky. You are chode, man. Exactly. Run that. It's a great asshole. Run that. Let's do it. You got some on your beard. I don't care. That's what it's there for. Thank you. It's for later. Flavor saver. Have a great day. Sell lots of good juice to lots of cool people. Hey, you guys got those hookers in the back? <laughs> Um, Hello, my name is Greg. Uh, my voice is not peaking on this microphone. No, it's not. No, it's not. My name's Old Greg. 